Hello, my name is Josh. I am the product training manager at Yext. Today, I will be walking you through the process of adding a single entity to your content. Yext Content is a brain-like database that stores all of your brand's information. It is composed of primary objects called entities, which represent individual people, places, products, or whatever else you use Yext to store information about. Information about these entities is populated within fields. Information within the fields is then used to power the Yext products and services associated with your platform. If you want to add information about a place, person, or product into your content that isn't already represented by an existing entity, you'll need to create a new one. We'll begin by clicking Add Content. Under the Add Single Entity option, we'll pick which entity type we want. Depending on how your content is configured, you might have options for different entity types, such as FAQs or a generic location. Each entity type is configured to contain fields relevant to that type of entity. In this example, we're going to be creating a new storefront for a fast casual restaurant, so we'll select Restaurant. Next, we'll populate the name, category, and address. You can also populate a phone number and a featured message. Under Additional Settings, you can further configure this entity. There are options to select the country, apply field values from a template, store this entity in a folder, and set the language. Once we're done, we will click Save. After a quick refresh, we'll find the new entity populated in content. To make further edits, just click on the entity and you'll be brought to the Entity Edit page. Thanks for tuning in today, and I hope you enjoyed this demo. Please visit our YouTube channel or hitchhikers.yext.com for more content and continued learning.